I've been playing the Cycle Frontier for a while now, and I was surprised by the number of people that have said they've had nearly no friendly encounters in this game because I've had so many. So I wanted to make a video on how to have more friendly interactions with people so that you don't get killed and lose all of that precious loot. Every time you come across somebody in the cycle, it's all or nothing. Most people think that other players just want to kill you and take all your loot. And a lot of the time, that's true. Are you friendly? However, most people are just trying to survive and complete their objectives like you. So how can you make sure that the person you're coming across isn't going to try to take your head off and take your stash? The solution? You need a mic in this game. The number one way to have an encounter that doesn't end in bloodshed is announcing your existence before they even know you're there. Are you friendly? Oh shit, yeah. Alright, you kind of scared me there. Oh fuck, you scared the sh more shit out of me, bud. If you just bump into somebody, it's already on. There's normally no time to talk it out. Oh, hello. And if one party shoots the other first, most of the trust has gone after that. It kills me how many people are running around in this game with no care in the world making a bunch of racket. The sound design in this game is incredible. There are so many cues in this game that will let you know people are nearby if you pay attention. When you're running around, stop every now and then to just listen. You'll hear gunfire or footsteps, people breathing. Creatures will give away other players' locations as well, so use them to your advantage. The other issue is that some people will try to deceive you. So don't be too trusting and always keep an eye on them. And leave a comment if you've ever been lied to and lost all your gear to some toxic enemy. You can tell people are trying to cheat you if they either don't reply to your call out or if they say they'll leave you alone but you can hear them still walking around you or coming towards you. An example of that is I was mining in this cave and I heard this guy sneaking up on me. Hey, 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 look, we don't have to fight, we don't have to fight! You'd think he'd leave but I didn't hear him walk away. Yes, we do. Most people who really want to get away with their gear don't want to hang around a potential threat. You're trying to what? I'm gonna head down this way, buddy. All right, have a good, have a good game. <laughs> yeah, have a good game too. You can either pretend that you have no gear and are just trying to complete an objective, and people will typically let you be on your way. Or you can stand out as a stronger opponent, and they most likely won't want to lose their gear. So it's up to you how you want to play it. You may be wondering why would you even want to have friendly encounters in this game. Well, it's fun. Sometimes you just want to play alone and complete your objectives, but teaming up with other people and running around destroying other teams and working together to defend a location while the other is looting can help you be way more successful. Also, meeting people is a great way to learn more about the game. There is so much to learn and rolling through the map with a partner can help both of you learn stuff that can make you a better player. If you do want to play a solo, it can also be nice to have friendly encounters because it can get you an evac ship that's closer to your location. Do you have a uh, evac nearby? I'll join you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, far. yeah, yeah. Come with me. Come with me. All right. Well, you have a good day. All right. Yeah, you do the same, buddy. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> or to make sure you don't lose all your gear if you're carrying a bunch of good stuff and don't have anything to protect yourself with. But really, it's just fun playing with other people you meet and can lead to a lot of interesting situations. Hopefully you try some of these things out. I've had so much fun on this game so far and I really do think it's so much more fun when you play with other people. Let me know in the comments if you agree or if you just bash anybody you come across. Thank you so much if you watched it all the way through. Please like and subscribe to help my channel grow. And if you really enjoyed it, come over and see me at twitch.tv slash ostubesocks. We can play together or you can just watch the stream and chat. I'll see you on the next one.